The De Winton's Golden Mill was last seen in 1937 and later declared officially lost. It evaded contact with humans and swam through the sand dunes without leaving any visible tunnels, making it nearly impossible to locate. But last month, a team of conservationists and geneticists announced the rediscovery of the mole in the sand dunes of the Northern Cape province after nearly two years of research. We were incredibly excited about this discovery. The rediscovery of De Winton's Golden Mole offers us a chance to learn more about this fascinating small mammal that so far has been poorly understood. It also offers an opportunity to reinvigorate conservation efforts for threatened golden moles and their habitats, and gives hope to find other species scientists presume to be extinct. The fact that we could use environmental DNA, which is the DNA that organisms shed into their environment, to find such an elusive species after lots of work refining our techniques was really a breakthrough. And it was a privilege to be involved in this project alongside an incredibly passionate team of conservationists. I'm Samantha Maynard from the Endangered Wildlife Trust, and I was the conservation genetics researcher on this project.